If you've been on the hunt for a video editing software for your PC that's easy to use, doesn't freeze every two seconds, and doesn't cost a fortune, I think I found the one. What's up everyone, it's Millie. Welcome back to my channel where I post videos every Wednesday teaching you the latest strategies and trends on social media to help you grow your brand. So give a little love tap on that subscribe button to stay up to date on all the latest tips and tricks I have for you. First, I wanna give a huge thank you to this video's shout outs. I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for all of you. If you wanna shout out in one of my future videos, screenshot yourself watching this video and tag me on Instagram stories or leave a comment below and subscribe to my channel. As always, timestamps will be in the comments down below because I value your time and you already know why you're here. So let's get into it. The editing software we are going to be using today is Clipchamp. Now Clipchamp reached out to me back in June offering to sponsor a video review on my channel. And I'll be honest, I was a little hesitant at first. When I first started my YouTube channel, I had recently switched from a Mac to a PC, which meant I could no longer use my comfort blanket iMovie. <laughs> So I literally tried a dozen editing tools and I never found one that I liked. They were either too expensive, too slow and glitchy, or every video would save with a watermark. So I just got frustrated. Not only that experience alone made me hesitant, but as you know, I'm super picky with the sponsors that my team picks out. So now not only that experience alone made me hesitant, but as you know, I'm also super particular with the sponsors that myself and my team pick. So I really needed to see it in order to believe it. You know, well now it's October and I'm actually pretty impressed with what I've seen so far. So I thought I'd finally share with you all my honest review within this sponsored video. And then you can decide from this information whether this platform is exactly what you're looking for or not. Alrighty, so you can find Clipchamp in both the Microsoft store for PC users and the Google Play store. So I am just going to Clipchamp and then it says it's free, so you would just click it and download. I did already download it because I wanted to test it around, so I'm gonna press get. Now, this is what it looks like inside of Clipchamp. As you can see from the dashboard, you can see that they're catering their product to both personal creators and or businesses. So you have the option for like social media ads, long form content like YouTube, you could do Pinterest, education, sales ads, and so on. So you can see that they are user friendly for both individual creators and businesses. What's cool is you can add your media directly from Dropbox, from Google Drive, OneDrive, Zoom, all of the things. I find that really convenient or browsing your files directly on your computer. I'm gonna see what files are on my computer. Oh, great, that was fast. Wow. Wow. I, I uploaded it and I was like, oh shoot, I forgot this has to upload to Clipchamp and that literally took less than 10 seconds for an 11 minute video. Okay, so this video is already edited, but I'm just bringing it over to show you the basic functionalities of Clipchamp at an overview. Again, this is a review. So we're gonna see how easy it is or hard to get the full editing experience compared to other video editing software softwares that I've used. So it was pretty easy to drag the clip over. That's pretty self-explanatory. A common edit that I do or a common function that I do is like the split tool where I cut two things in half. So something that I'm noticing while I'm editing is how fast it moves with me. Something that I really didn't like when I was looking for other editing softwares was anytime I would try to edit or upload footage or then make a bunch of cuts and then add music and add all of these layers. As I would edit my video, it would just get slower and slower and slower. And as I'm editing this, it's not uh, nothing slowed down yet. So that's pretty cool. That's really great. Something that my video editors have been doing a lot more of lately is adding fun GIFs within my videos, fun little memes or pop-ups. So it's cool that they're directly integrated with Giphy and I could add those directly to my video. Pretty darn awesome. And then just something that I'm noticing on the side, we have my media. I could record right into it, which most softwares have. They have templates, which I don't think a lot of softwares have templates. So if I just wanted to go to the very end. So if I replace the current video, it'll probably crop the footage that I already have. Have. So I'm gonna create a new video. So now I have two different projects that I'm working on. I have one for the long form video, YouTube, and then this one is like a fun Instagram story. Hey guys, look, I have a new post. So we could zoom in, see how long this post is. It's about six seconds. Let's see what it looks like. Play. Okay, this is pretty, this is kind of exciting. A lot of people will ask like, Millie, how did you make the tech pop up like that? Or how did you add this grainy filter on top of this? This template, it literally broke it down for you. So this is the vintage sticker. This is how they made the text kind of like staticky. This is the movement of the hand pointing. This is the overlay filter or the overlay filter that you see. So it basically breaks it down for you when you use a template of like, hey, this is how you do this. This is how you make the filters 
the fade, the speed, layout, like it's already done for you. And then you could just manipulate it however the heck you want. I find that fascinating. Now, just looking at everything on the side that they offer, we have templates, music, and sound effects. We kind of already touched on that. So something that I do know is that Clipchamp does offer a full comprehensive paid library of 800,000 plus premium stock videos, photos, audio files with the full commercial license built in. So you don't have to worry about any sort of royalties or budgets, none of that. And I like that it's built in and it doesn't look too cheesy. <laughs> now, what if I wanted to export this? Say everything looked good. We can change the name. So you would wanna change the name to like new post for Instagram video. In order to do 720 or 1080, you would have to upgrade. So just for now, I'm gonna do 480 and then we'll talk about the different upgrade options. And cool, while you're exporting, you can actually export directly like save to YouTube, pin to Pinterest, save to Google Drive. So that's really cool. You could just save directly onto those things, which is convenient for like my YouTube videos. Let's go to upgrade and let's talk about pricing, how it compares to other plans. Now comparing Clipchamp pricing to other options out there. You have Adobe Premiere Pro where it's $31.50 a month or you could pay $240 a year. Anybody who is a beginner or maybe you're just starting on YouTube, that is a stretch to pay for. Now Final Cut Pro, it's great because it's just one flat payment and it's yours for forever. And I think that's $300. The only con with Final Cut Pro is that it's not available for PC users and I'm a PC user. So I couldn't use Final Cut Pro. Adobe Premiere Pro was like, oh my gosh, it's so expensive. And then Clipchamp, let's go to upgrade. While there is the free version, which is the one that I was using this whole time, what I would recommend is going with either the creator or the business account. I would say if you're somebody who's just starting out and you're, I don't want to say you're unsure if you want to be pursuing YouTube full time or Instagram full time, but you haven't tried it out yet. You haven't been doing it for a while. Start with the creator. That's $9 a month and it's $72 up front. This gives you a 720 export and you really only, the minimum quality on Instagram is 720 and then YouTube can go lower than that. So I think it's a really good happy medium for you to just test it out feel a rhythm with yourself and be like, okay, how often can I actually post? How often am I editing videos? Is this something I even like doing? So that's pretty good for $9 a month. Then if you're somebody who's like, no, I know this is what I want to do and I'm committed to it. I already set a goal to post like 52 videos for the next year. Once a week, I'm ready. I got 10 ideas ready to film right now. Then I would go with the business plan. So this is paying monthly $19 a month, or you could pay yearly, which is $156 total, still half the price of Adobe Premiere Pro. Or if you would just to be a boss and get access to all like the stock imagery as well you could go with the business platinum that's $39 a month or you could pay that one upfront fee of $324 that gives you access to unlimited cloud storage audio stock video stock imagery stock and the branding kit if you're somebody who uses stock imagery often and you have like multiple subscriptions to a bunch of websites for the stock imagery this would be great to just do everything in one you just pay one price and you get access to not only a video editing software but all stock imagery and audio so you don't have to also pay for a separate subscription for audio files. There's businesses out there that offer copyright free music for YouTube and stock imagery for Instagram and stock imagery for this, all of those separate platforms. This is just a great all in one. If you're somebody who's just like, I'm ready, let's do this full time. All in one business platinum would be a good way to go. So if I choose business platform, I could come here, use the code clipchamp modern Millie and apply it and boom shakalaka, you get it for free. So you would get one month free of the business platform so you can test it out, see if you like it see if this is something that you're like yeah i'm gonna use this all the time and if it is great i got you boo boo if not set a reminder on your phone so you know when to cancel <laughs> but yeah overall i'm pretty impressed with even the simplicity of how to use clipchamp if you're somebody who's not familiar with how to edit videos at all it's pretty straightforward walk like it's pretty straightforward period now if i have this upgraded one you can get this brand kit where you have your logos fonts colors love it that's pretty freaking cool i definitely wish i saw this like over a year ago when I first started on YouTube, it would have made my life a heck of a lot easier instead of like trying to subscribe to all these different platforms that offered completely different things and paying like $35 here and then another $15 here all every single month. So basically pay paying maybe 50 to 60, sometimes 70, depending on the tier you have, $70 a month for all these things and you could just do it all in one. 
pretty impressed. What do you think? Overall, as you could see, I really enjoyed my experience editing through ClipChamp. If I didn't enjoy my editing experience, I wouldn't have accepted a brand collaboration with them or a sponsored video. If you've been on the hunt for a video editing software, especially for PC users, especially if you're a beginner, or even if you want to edit different things for Instagram, YouTube, ads, Pinterest, all the things, I think this is a really great all-in-one platform for all the things that you would need for video editing. I'm impressed. I wish I found this sooner. I definitely re recommend just trying it out, seeing if it fits your needs, what you are looking for. And if it is what you're looking for, then definitely use my code. Also drop a link for how to redeem your code. If you're having, I don't know if you don't know if you're having issues for how to redeem the code, I'll definitely drop a link with like the walkthrough explanation of, Hey, this is how you redeem the code. Clipchamp Modern Millie. So if you've made it this far and you're not already subscribed to my channel, make sure to click on that subscribe button and turn on the bell notification so you don't miss when I post my videos and I will see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching. Follow your joy. Bye. Thank you.